It's our big story at five. Sturgeon spearing season starts this weekend, but already spearers are out on the ice preparing to catch that big fish. They're setting up shanties and cutting holes so they're ready to go bright and early Saturday morning. NBC 26's Raquel Lamel was there and takes us to Lake Winnebago. Hundreds of spears taken to the ice today on Lake Winnebago, among them James Dorn of Appleton. We have a blast. We look forward to this every year. Dorn spearing sturgeon for years. But this year, he's expecting to catch the big one. We've already checked the clarity, and it seems to be pretty good. It's a little, can get a little cloudy because of the river over here, but we're, we're expecting to be able to see bottom fairly well. But it's not just Spears preparing for the big event. Members of the Atta Street Fishing Club are moving bridges and plowing roads after this week's snow. All our roads got plugged up, and the bridges got all full of snow and packed in, and. So we just come out here to get everything ready because it's, this is going to get really busy today and tomorrow. Lake Winnebago will be filled with shanties and cars on the ice by Friday afternoon as people come from across the Midwest to see if they can spear a trophy sturgeon. Sturgeon spearing runs almost two weeks or until one of the caps is filled. In Oshkosh, Raquel Amell, NBC 26. The DNR has sold a record number of more than 13,000 sturgeon spearing licenses this year. The season opens at 7 a.m. on Saturday.